Thinking about a trip to Cancun, there are 125 hotels in this destination, and Roberto here is the president of the Hotel Association. So Roberto, where do you start to figure out which property is right for you as a consumer? Well, the first thing they do, the customers, many times, most of the times, they check with a travel agent. That's right. what they do. Yeah, the travel pro. And, uh, and we do many things to convince travel agents to send people to our properties. We have brochures, we also have pages. And they have the wholesalers. Right. They rely on their wholesalers very much. You know, it's interesting you say that because mm -hmm. when the hotels are bookable through the wholesaler, mm -hmm. it's a negotiated rate and that savings gets passed on to the consumer. So yeah. for the consumer that's watching, they need to understand that they're going to save money booking through a travel agent because they're selling a wholesaler. That is right. Yeah, at a yeah. much better, better price. Now, as far as what they can experience, there's a, high, a wide range. You can go from one star to five and a half, six stars plus. So um, as far as the amenities, what are some of the things that they can experience here on the product side from a hotel well, standpoint? Many people come into Cancun and to Mexico in general. What they expect first is that they are going to be welcome. They are going to find a good service, but also good facilities. And in the case of Cancun, uh, they also know that they are going to find many things to do. Many things to do. Right. We have a nightlife. We have very good shopping. Very, very good shopping. Yep, yep. And we have many areas where they can go. Down south, up north. Now, if you're, we have many, many if, islands. If you're active, you want to play sports, what types of sports are, are available? Oof, all, all, all of them. Uh, we have very good golf now. There are about nine golf courses in Cancun. And they are very good. They are professional. Well, you have uh, signature golf courses, yes, right? Yes, yes, there are signature Absolutely. golf courses here in Cancun. Now, what about the dining options? Talk a little bit about the dining options with these properties. We have from little restaurants downtown, and we have to the best restaurants. And many, many Americans, especially, come uh, and look for uh, Mexican food. Mm -hmm. Mexican food is very popular in the states. Right, of course. Actually, yeah. you find more Mexican restaurants in the States <laughs> than in Mexico. And probably Chinese restaurants too, right? <laughs> That's right, yeah. <laughs> so, so, no, absolutely. Uh, as far as you mentioned hospitality, I always find it interesting when I come to Mexico. Mm -hmm. I find uh, the thing that, that differentiates a destination and a product mm -hmm. outside of the infrastructure of the product itself mm -hmm. are the people. What is it about the Mexican hospitality that stands out globally? Well, we are very much used to give our hospitality. We are very warm people. We are also very happy people. And uh, Cancun was, was uh, considered one of the happiest cities in Mexico. So uh, we have to offer that, the warmth, the hospitality of our people here in Cancun. Well, and you know what? There are mm -hmm. 125 hotels to choose mm -hmm. from. 105 of them are uh, members of the Hotel Association, and Roberto is the president. So there's some insight to a guy who knows a little bit about the hotel situation here in Cancun. And you're right, it is a happy place, and I'm pretty happy because I'm right now in Cancun with this interview. Thanks for watching.